YouTube, what is good? Welcome back to a brand new tutorial. It's your boy Jacob from Tiny Tapes here. Today, I'm going to be showing you guys how you recreated this 3D text effect from the Yeet Get Busy music video. If you guys want to go download the project file and follow along, it will be linked in the description below. All right, guys, so we are in After Effects. First off, to get started, we're going to right click, go to New, and create a new solid. We're going to call this Element. Then we're going to go to Effects and Presets and type in Element. If you guys don't have Element 3D, you're going to need it for this tutorial. We're going to drag and drop that on there. Go over to our text tool up here and then click and let's type Yeet or whatever title you're going to do. I have this font here. You guys can pick any font you want and boom just like that we're actually going to turn this layer off and then go back into element under element we're going to go under custom layers custom text and math and then under path layer one right here where it says none you're going to click that and click on yeet so what this is doing is it's bringing the text layer into element and then we're going to go into our scene setup we're going to hit extrude right here and boom our yeet text is in there by clicking and dragging we can move around we can scroll in and out to zoom in and out and then holding spacebar and clicking and dragging we can move around just like so all right now you want to drop this down here click on the bevel and then we can extrude here i suggest making this really really long for the sake of the warp it kind of does all right now once that is there we're gonna hit okay all right guys now next step is we want to go and duplicate this file right here and then right click on it pre-compose and then hit the bottom one here move all attributes just you don't want to open the composition hit okay we're gonna open it up i'm gonna add camera lens blow to that drag and drop that on there i think five is about good the preset we're gonna go back into our composition now and then this time we're gonna go to custom texture maps right here we're gonna go over to layer one like none and then we're gonna load it into the bottom one the blurred one all right guys so what we're gonna do we're gonna go into our render settings and then we are going to go under physical environment our override layer right here we're gonna click that and we're gonna make that our comp that we just created all right and now we're gonna go back into our scene setup we're gonna make sure we have an environment off here and then we're gonna go into our environment up here now going into our environment we can play around as you guys can see with the uv repeat just like that now you just want to mess around with it until you get what you're looking for let's change this to 12 and this one to about there hit okay all right guys once we have our reflection sorted out and looking good i really like the way this looks we can move on to our next step here which is going into deform going into twist and then enabling it once you have that enabled there we are going to go to twist z as you guys can see it's the effect from the music video where it twists out just like that we're going to keyframe twist z and we are going to twist it to about let's do 25 and at the end here we'll bring it to 25 so it goes from minus 25 to 25 All right, guys, and to sell the look a lot more, we're going to throw on RSMB. I like having it about three or four for this effect. I think four it is. It really sells it there. If you guys want to play with it a little bit more, you can go and add a uni glow onto that. I sort of like the way uni glow looks. It obviously looks way too much right now, but if we bring the intensity down to something like 0.2 and see the before and after, kind of has a cool look and boom guys that is the effect there if you guys want to go download the project file it will be linked in the description below so you guys can recreate this on your videos if you guys enjoyed this video i recommend checking out our last video alongside a playlist of a bunch of other tutorials i think you guys will mess with alongside a playlist of a bunch of other tutorials i think you guys will mess with thank you guys so much for watching i'll catch you guys in the next one